So this is part two or in the step two cash investment. So we will focus item number two. The firm purchase raw material one month in advance before sale. Purchase which are which the purchases are approximately 40% of the monthly sales. Let's say that sales in December 250,000 multiply by 40%, this 100,000 become a purchase of November and so on. Like December based on January, January based on February, February based on March, March based on April. So come to the trick, the the tips you need to have two months before and also one month upfront. All right. The second one is the firm will pay its suppliers fifty percent of the purchases one month after. Meaning that after you buy in November, you will pay one month December in a December and then another balance fifty thousand in January. So it's also. For example, and so on, December, January, February, and March. Even though, why we need to focus this? Because you can see here, January and February is in our quarter. That's why the tips, you must remember that you need to have a two months before. Okay. We go for our um, format here to answer the in a step two purchases so this is a blank here so it's referred to a forward sales so in this you will calculate so you will get a hundred thousand seventy two sixty eight eighty eight and seventy thousand all right so the highlighted in it is the prepare cash budget we need for this question. So we can see payment of account payable 50% one month after purchase. So when you pay 100,000 here, it purchase 100,000. So you need to pay December 50,000 and also a So you will get fifty thousand from hundred thousand. So another thousand you need to pay a balance in sixty thousand, and it will follow and so on. So I will suggest you to do like this: hundred thousand, fifty thousand, fifty thousand. So we move to the next month. So you will get sixty thousand. So we move to this here is sixty thousand. So settle see January. So a month before, and also a two month before. See why I need to open a November and December. Okay, now we go for. February and March and for March so we go for why we are not doing in April so if you want to do you still can do like if you want you can just put 44,000 for enough from here so you already finish the item 2 so we can see the salary is a 15,000, 15%, sorry, 15%. See, salary paid to employee are 15% the previous month sales. See how important to have a month sales before. So when you calculate, you will get. You will get and you calculate, you will 
get right so this one you will get a 30 30 37 37500 okay how do i get 37500 right 200 salary in general in january will multiply 50 percent from december 250 000 here sales so you need to be more careful so this one february based on january this one march is based on february right rental expense okay in the question said rental expense item rental expense is 12,000 per month and expected to be paid however firm is expected to receive 5% discount on rental expense in March so you can see here when you calculate you can get amount 12,000 12,000 is a fixed expense so at the March you need to calculate and discount is her uh, from 12,000 discount 5% alright so you will get 11,400 and then how about interest expense is a uh, 6,400 are due in January and March will not be in the February so when you need to put this one 6400 6, 6400 not in yeah, because in the question they say interest expense is only for January and March so about how about cash bonuses all right cash bonuses is 40,000 and expected to disburse in February so they will firm will pay in February so firm will pay February 40,000 right Second last item, the first plan to buy a new equipment cash amount 120,000 see in February. So February purchase equipment then you put 1000 1200 all right so after that and again and again I will say to you don't try to sum up this only sum up from here okay and you no need to sum up the december because our focus is january february and march so we total all this so you will get a 141900 1 so we will get a total cash disbursement again the tips is you must to have a column for two months and also one month in advance so to be recap you can see my arrow is words this down word see Okay, word the downwards this one. Alright, so you already finish in step two. We will continue in part three. Thank you.